Hi, this is Terry from Rock Solid Technical Services. I'm going to show you how to create a virtual switch supporting multiple VLANs using the VMware vSphere 4 client. I'm already logged into the vSphere client and connected to an ESX server currently. First, highlight the server over on the left hand pane. Then go to the configuration tab. Make sure you're clicked on networking. Here you see the existing virtual switch. To create a new one, click Add Networking to the right hand side. I'm going to select a connection type of virtual machine and we'll end up moving the VMs to the different VLANs that I create on the other switch. So virtual machine is selected. You could also choose from VM kernel or service console for the different types of connection types. We're going with virtual machine. Select next. Then you can select the actual network card that it's going to connect to. Select next. The port group properties, the network label, and the VLAN ID. And select next. Now we have a virtual switch with one VLAN port created on it. I'm going to continue adding VLANs on this same switch. Click properties of this switch. We're going to select add under ports. And again I'm going to go with a virtual machine. Next. Select a network label and the VLAN ID. And finish again. I'm going to do this one more time. Again, clicking Add, Virtual Machine, Next. Label again, and the VLAN ID, and finish. The switch now has three VLAN ports. Now I'm going to go ahead and move these virtual machines to these VLAN ports. Click on the virtual machine, edit the virtual machine settings. On the hardware tab, click the network adapter. On the left hand side under network connection, network label, now you can choose the other ports on the other switches. Go with VLAN 1 for this one. Click OK. And if we go back and look at the switches, we now see that this virtual machine has moved to VLAN 1. I'll go ahead and move the other machines. Again, on the left hand side, click on the virtual machine. Edit the virtual machine settings. On the hardware tab, Click on the network adapter, and on the right hand side, network connection, and choose the connection. Click OK. And we'll move on to the third virtual machine. Edit the settings. On the hardware tab, click on the network adapter, and on the right hand side, the network connection, we're going to choose VLAN 3. Now we'll move back to the SX server. In the configuration tab, networking, we see the two switches. And the second switch that we created with three VLANs, each has its own virtual machine. Thank you for watching.